from McKinney's Kitchen. Okay, everybody. Summer is here, but we are all Seattleites and we know you cannot always count on the weather. So today we're gonna make kebabs indoors. We're gonna start with a really delicious marinade. I'm going to use some fresh oregano, some fresh parsley, and some chopped up thyme, and a little bit of chopped garlic. You can put more if you like more garlic. And then some salt and pepper, and this is so simple to make. Once you have all of that in there, we're gonna add in a olive oil and grapeseed oil or canola oil blend. Add all of that in there and give it a stir and voila, you have this really tasty herb oil marinade. And once your herb oil is ready and your veggies are chopped, like I have here, you're gonna pour the herb oil on top of the veggies and let them set overnight. And I know when you think of kebabs, you think of meat. Not to worry, we have that covered. We're gonna use this really delicious Beyond Meat sausage. This is the hot Italian one, and it's available in any store locally. So I'm gonna cut this into about four pieces so you still have a good amount of meat on your skewer. It's important to get the meat in the marinade and then cook it first, because it will cook at a different rate than your veggies will. I already have some in here that's marinating that I'm gonna pull out and I'm going to saute. So we're gonna let these cook a little bit first because I don't wanna overcook my veggies once I get to the skewer part. So you wanna let them brown on all sides. Then we're gonna make the skewer and throw it back in the pan. These look like they're ready to be skewed. So you start here with peppers at the bottom and then you need something to sort of anchor your skewer, a larger piece of something. So then we're gonna go mushroom. And then we're going to go our par-cooked meat. And so I don't have a stack of meat in the middle. I'm gonna break it up with a purple onion. And then basically from here, repeat. So these guys are ready to go. Pan is smoking a little bit, that's good. Let's throw them on. They should cook maybe one to two minutes per side. So you wanna do like a four time turn on your skewer so you get it cooked all the way around. Okay, I think it's ready. Let's get this on a tray. And there you have it, veggie skewers, summer indoors. Enjoy. Mm -hmm.